block on the conveyor. We push the two buttons, the guides, place the box in the center. This diffuse detector detects the box, activates the robots, which then transfer arm to arm, and the part will finally end up in this box here. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't. Here's a helpful little nudge from one to the other. So we start over here with the kit that Arduino and DigiKey have assembled together. We have the Arduino Opta on a phase dock board with a phase dock switch plate. It features industrial 22 millimeter switches, a 35 millimeter DIN rail, and a variety of industrial parts or parts to put it together. You'll notice it doesn't have any fancy wire duct or other wire markers on it, and that's done intentionally. So the students can get in there with a screwdriver and practice assembling it and wiring up other parts like the relays and the sensors. The way it works, with regards to the conveyor is we have a sensor. This sensor will detect the presence of a box. So I'll just put one here, right? So now the box has been detected and that signal goes over to the Opta and then a command is sent over to the robots to perform a mission that's already been entered into their EE front. So sensor over back to the Arduino from the Arduino via serial line, an RS-485, to the robot controller, which is another Arduino, and it will start mission number one, and it'll perform the operation we just saw. Let's go ahead and look at that one more time. So I put the box on. You'll notice we have these guides. We have a two-finger safety. We have part is aligned. It's detected by the sensor, and the robots take over.